Hey everyone, this is Matt over at Huber Vester Toyota Used Car Sales Manager and today we're going to go over what happens behind the scenes in an appraisal for your trade-in. Now if you'll come up here with me today, I've got a RAV4 that I guess has traded in recently. I'm just going to kind of go through the process that I go through on every car that comes in here. Now it's not just me looking at the car. I've actually got an application that sends this vehicle out to over a thousand wholesalers and I have over four wholesalers that come in here on a regular basis to look at cars with me to make sure that I don't miss your deal or miss your price on your trade. In case my appraisal is too low, I've always got other options. So the first thing that we're always going to look at are going to be tires because that's one of our biggest expenses here at the dealership when reconditioning the car. As you can see up here, if you'll zoom in, you can see that vehicle there has excellent tires on it. And if you'll look right here, that's the wear bar. Now when we start getting down to that area, that's when we know we need to, re, to put new tires on the vehicle. Also small things like scratches, you know, little dings, dents. Of course on a little bit older vehicle this is to be expected, but of course if you're buying a new vehicle from me or a used vehicle from me, you're going to want these things taken care of. I go around the car completely and make sure that I check out everything that's good, bad, and indifferent. Now, we use what's called appraisal lane. This is what all the wholesalers are hooked up to on the east coast of North Carolina. I can simply come up here, scan the VIN, and it's going to tell me absolutely everything I need to know about this vehicle. Now after I do that, I'm going to go through and take multiple pictures of this vehicle to send out. Now this one was appraised at night so the pictures aren't the best, but I take pictures as you can see inside, outside, up, down, around, odometer, tires, under the hood, everything. So I just want to keep my eye out for any problems and all the good things too to make sure that I get you the most for your vehicle and a fair appraisal. Always going to check underneath the hood. I always like to see a nice, neat, clean engine compartment, corrosion on the battery, things like leaks around the head gasket, stuff like that will be things that we're concentrating on. I prefer a clean car when we come in, but sometimes I understand that they are dirty and I've got a detail department that will help me out with that. So that's the gist of it. Just kind of want to give you guys an orientation as to what happens behind the scenes because I know a lot of times you guys don't come out here with me and look at these vehicles and I'll come back to you and I'll ask some questions and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back into the office, I'm going to get on the computer and it won't necessarily be my opinion. I take a look at NADA, I take a look at Kelly Blue Book, I take a look at Black Book, I look at what they go for on auction if it is an older car that I don't plan on keeping and I get opinions from other people, like I said, other wholesalers that come in here that purchase the vehicles that I don't retail so that I can make sure I get you the most money for your vehicle and the best deal on your car. If you have any questions, you can always reach me at 252-291-5300. This is Matt Hilburn with Hubert Vester Toyota, where we are the difference.